All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures beta. Learn basic string and array methods by building a music player. Step 35. All right. So next we're going to use the class list property and the add method to add the playing class to the play button element. And this is going to look for the class playing in the CSS file and add it to the play button element, right? And then to finally play the song, we're going to use the play method on the audio variable. And the play method is from the web audio API for playing an MP3 file. All right. So those are pretty, this plays pretty much self-explanatory. So what we're going to do here is we'll say uh, play button. Whoops. Come over here and say play. What are we doing? There we go. Play button dot class list. And then we're going to say dot add. And what we're going to add is the uh, playing class, playing class like that. All right. And then we're going to come down here and say audio dot play like that. All right. So this playing class is going to be over here in CSS. We'll just scroll down a little bit and we'll try to find it. Play, play, playing, playing, playing. I think I went too far. Right here. All right. So it's going to change it to, it to this class, which is going to target the SVG, this this SVG right here, the scalable vector graphic. And it's going to give it the fill of our highlight color, right? So highlight color is going to be this gold color right here, right? Let's get rid of the CSS. And then this play is just going to play the uh, audio track as well. So when we push this, well, nothing's happened yet. Let's check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 36 and we'll see you next time.